spreading the love to all we've gathered Trying to pretend it doesn't matter But it does Yes it does Yes it does Yes it does And we're out on the road once again Stretching forth our hands Reaching for a friend Wondering if this trail will ever end As we're looking for America again Yes, we're looking for America again Verda National National Park on the Step House Trail getting ready to go and see what the Step House is all about one mile out one mile back two mile return on the trip doesn't seem like too bad a hike let me show you where we're going
For over 700 years, the ancient Puebloan people had built their homes in the, the cliffs and the cliff openings of Mesa Verde. Today, Mesa Verde National Park protects over 26 of these ruins and tribal people that lived in this area. Mesa Verde means green table in Spanish and has to do with the number of juniper trees that grow in it and on it.
President Theodore Roosevelt declared Mesa Verde a national park in 1906. His reason for doing this was to preserve the number of cliff dwellings that were in the area. There are currently in the Mesa Verde area over 4,000 archaeological sites and over 600 cliff dwellings. So I think Theodore Roosevelt was probably right. It is very important to preserve this area. Somehow I can't see them turning uh, Pueblos into modular homes or condominiums or anything like that, but at the same time, it's kind of nice to preserve them and, and keep them right where they're at. Badger House Trail 
2.4 miles. It's a loop trail. Just to take a look at the area and see what what is here at the National Park. I feel that it's safe to say that Michelle and I thoroughly enjoyed our trip to Mesa Verde National Park in uh, Colorado. If you're into uh, ancient history of the West, as we are, it's uh, a very interesting place to go. Not only is there the Step House and the Cliff Palace, but there is also the Kodak House, the Badger House, the Raven House, and two Raven House to explore and to look and see what these ancient people had devised and, and built, much of which is still standing today, which is more than what you can say to about some buildings that are being built today. But I would highly recommend, and I'm sure that Michelle would agree with me, that a visit to Mesa Verde would be well worth your time. And besides that, there is plenty of scenery to be seen with all the mountains all around. So be sure to put it on your bucket list and take the time to go see it yourself.
at this point in the video make a suggestion if you enjoy the content that we send your way if you like the adventures that the adventure results take and send to you why not take the time to subscribe and like our channel it would be a great help to us and and we really appreciate you taking the time to watch.